Alrighty guys, Kentucky survives Troy 70-62. Now we have a game with Fort Wayne tonight. And uh, we're going to look back at the Troy game a little bit here. You know, you know we struggled. That's just how it goes. The process continues for Kentucky basketball now. We're going to be fine. I can see so much potential with this team, people, still, even though we won 70 to 62. Uh, Kentucky, let's look at what happened with the players here. We have Knox. He's continuing to step up with 17 points, still playing great. 7 or 12 shooting. Diallo struggled with 8 points, but he had 10 rebounds. And Green, 13 points, 3 assists. I'd like to see him get 6, 7 assists a game. Gabriel showed up this game, 27 minutes, 12 points, 6 rebounds. We shot 44% from the field and 33% on three-pointers. You got to give it to Troy. They came in there and they gave Kentucky a nice, a nice go for it. Now, Kentucky only dropped from 7 to 8 with that loss to Kansas. So that shows that the committee respects Kentucky and they see the potential that we all see in the Kentucky Wildcats the greatest college basketball program of all time. And uh, Fort Wayne now tonight, what do we expect? We're not really sure people right now with these young kids, but still, what better way to spend a Wednesday night before Thanksgiving than to watch the Kentucky Wildcats, the greatest college basketball program of all time. That right there sounds like a fantasy to, my, to me, you know. So, well, That's them's good. Taco Bell Crunchy Chicken Taco review coming up tomorrow, by the way. These are wonderful. Let's stay patient, people. Just wait until Vanderbilt comes back. Wait till the team continues to grow. I'll just tell you the way I feel about this team. I feel, I can't explain it, but I just have a special feeling about this team. I know it's the youngest team we've ever had and all this stuff people talk about. Oh, they're so young. We've said it a million times and say, we'll say it a million more times. I just feel like they're gonna gel together because as I said in my last video, they're all in it together. They're all pretty much freshmen. They have nobody, in the, no, no, they have no juniors or seniors to depend on. They're gonna have to come together themselves. They have to trust themselves. They're all pretty much in the same boat. So let's look for Kentucky tonight against Fort Wayne. Oh, I'll say Kentucky. 75, Fort Wayne 50. Something like that. Seems like we scored in the 70s a lot lately. But trust the process. The process will continue all year. And we might get we might get a surprise later on in a month or so where this team absolutely comes together and they're like we're like wow. Fierce. They could be fierce, they could be unafraid because they're all freshmen. Band together and just become something special. Every year it's the same go, even though with some years it's not realistic and some years it's realistic. It's the same goal we have every year, people. It's not Final Four. It's not Final Eight. It's not Sweet 16. It's not making the tournament. Kentucky's goal is simple. National Championship. That's the way I've always seen it in basketball. And that should be every team's goal, I think, in every sport. It's just how it is. That's how I see it. That's how I've always seen it, especially with basketball, because we're at a higher standard. We're a blue blood. As always, guys, thanks for watching. Go Big Blue. Have a good Thanksgiving, and I'll see you later. Have a great day now.